The official start of lobster season was August 6. Key West will launch it with a three-day festival of fun, music, and of course, tons and tons of lobster. The festivities all benefit a scholarship fund for the Key West High School students. We're going to talk about it this morning before we go with the founder of the event, Mr. Mark Rossi. Mark, thank you for being well, on the show. Well, thanks for having me. It's a pleasure. Well, it's wonderful having you here. And now I want to know how in the world you came up with this event, Mark. Well, I used to be an old lobster hunter for a lot of years. Really? And uh, it was one of the highlights of our life. Uh, me and a bunch of guys would go out all the time, get lobsters, and particularly on this sport two-day season. And that's how it kind of got started. And we just had such a good time that one, one day we says, hey, let's try to do something uh, with lobster down in Dirty Harry's and Rick's, and we actually started this out on the uh, promenade area in between Rick's and Dirty Harry's and what we call the, the, the courtyard. Okay, so it just started right there. Started right there, and over the years it's really grown to turn out to be quite a festival. Mm -hmm. It's a family festival. This uh, festival is designed for families and people to have a good time. Tell me about uh, everything that takes place. There. Well, you know, we shut down, uh, actually we shut down all the way to the s probably the 600 block of Duval Street, a little bit past La Concha. It's uh, just a fun festival. We have all different types of restaurants, the bars, everybody sets up out in Duval Street. We have many different varieties of lobster, from lobster tempura to grilled lobster to lobster chilao to lobster fritters. It's a lobster fest. Can you say lobster, lobster? <laughs> lobster, lobster. She's a lobster. <laughs> well, it's wonderful, and I know it's a favorite of so many people, Mark. So It really is. And now along with all that lobster, you have entertainment going on. Yes, we do. we got old C.W. Colt, my old buddy. we got Alphonse down there. We've got Cool Breeze coming back in for another uh, year. I think Cool Breeze has been with us now for 10 or 15 years. A great band, plays a lot of reggae, all different types of music. Mm -hmm. It should be a great time. And you have an event at the Doubletree. Tell me about this event. The event at the Doubletree is uh, what we call a Sunday morning event. It's uh, a buffet out there that uh, Michael Knowles and his group do that features lobster omelets, lobster, uh, lobster benedict, uh, lobster tails, uh, lobster bisque. It's a pretty fun time, I gotta tell you. Boy, I leave there and I'm a big guy and I leave there full. <laughs> okay, favorite favorite place to get lobster out during the festival? Oh, well, there's only one place to get lobster. That's the grilled tail of Rick's and Dirty Aries. Yeah, okay, that's the You only might even place. see me out there grilling it. <laughs> really? They call me the grill daddy. You grill? Oh, yeah. Okay, so you're working the event. Oh, yeah, I so work the event. The it's founder. a lot of fun. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, wonderful. Now, if people want more information on this, where can they check? Well, they should look online to the Lobster Fest um, website, Eric mm -hmm. Adams. Um, I don't have Eric's number right in front of me. He has a, a landline that you can get, or just call me at 305-797-0544, and I can tell you more. Well, thank you for sharing all of this well, information. Well, thank you. Are you ready to get your lobster fix, Mark? I think I'm ready. How about you? That's the question. <laughs> I'm ready. Well, you know, you need to go out and get your lobster fix. we got to get you out and get you getting some lobster. Okay. You know, you don't live in the Florida Keys until you go out and get some lobster. Okay, wonderful. I'll do that. You'll you have take to, me, right? Yep. Take <laughs> you out on the rocket. All right. That's going to do it for us this morning, everyone. I'll be back tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. and again at 8.30 a.m. I hope you can join me. Have a great rest of your day. It'll be okay It'll be okay And that's what she says And that's